What's up guys, it's Gegna coming at you with some Metro Royale gameplay and in today's video I get a lot of level 6 skills, we, we get into some big fights but I just can't get any loot from those guys, I don't know why, I'm, I'm cursed or something like I can kill anyone and only the level 4 guys drop me like a level 4 west and that's it I just don't understand this but luckily there will be a boss that will drop me some level 6 gear and I usually don't even get lucky with the bosses but this time I actually do and at the end there will be some big fights at Rozok as you will see and then I will finally loot some level 6 things because they will be kills from other team so when, <laughs> when I loot other guys kills I can get some level 6 stuff but not when I kill them myself it's uh, very annoying but yeah we here some enemies at the shop so we are gonna push it naturally because that's just what we do so I will let you guys enjoy this fight Možná za budkou. Jdu k Danovi. Na skoro jich dole, dole, dole. Teď je v dolně pasu. Teď je v dolně pasu. Ne, je v dolně pasu. Pasu, pasu, pasu. So these guys got wrecked and I'm just gonna heal up and see what these guys drop but I can already see the crate is purple so I know it's gonna be just the dog tag and I still got a kill inside so hopefully he can drop something better as soon as I find him nope another purple crate as always I mean what is this and you will see I will kill more level 6 guys in a minute and they will not drop anything either I just don't understand dude but there are more enemies coming to Rozok so we're gonna get up and push those guys right away because we want those kills as soon as possible before another team comes because when you are in this area you usually get sandwiched very easily. Boj za jadu, spadřil za tebou. Kde? Kde je Vojto? Na tý budce? Jo. And unfortunately I got this kill stolen but it doesn't matter, it's a purple crate anyway. And I rushed him like YOLO, like 10 bullets in my MK, uh, I didn't even have my grenade launcher reloaded. And as you saw on the left there was a red crate, that was not my kill. So when I <laughs> when I don't kill these guys, they usually drop red. And as you see, I killed this level 4 guy, he dropped a level 4 west. Okay, so at least something. But now we will go to the boss finally and we will quickly kill him just to see what he drops and he drops red and let's see I actually got some high numbers and I actually won everything look at this so I think I need to kill the bosses if I want some loot so yeah this is very annoying guys <laughs> I should have way more <laughs> level 6 stuff but I guess it's just I don't know I don't know what it is I don't know I don't know why I cannot loot level 6 but anyway we are gonna continue into another game where we get into a fight in the underground and I hate fighting at the underground we will camp the underground for a bit and a team comes from the stairs and unfortunately we leave Richie alone and he gets killed and that's our bad because we should always split into two teams of uh, duos because one team should uh, watch over the escalators and one team should look over 
the stairs because this way you can always double grenade launch these guys and get an easy knock to start the fight but uh, unfortunately this time we split into three and one and Richie gets wrecked but after this I get a level six kill again and I'm pretty sure he doesn't drop anything again so here I'm gonna quickly try to loot Rishi just in case he dropped anything and we need to retreat because we cannot stay here for very long because we could get sandwiched but there's actually a guy right next to me and I almost die here luckily I get away with just a few HP so I'm just gonna heal up and we are gonna finish this fight So luckily there was just two of them and we quickly killed them so after reviving Kolda I'm gonna see what I can loot and of course it's a purple crate as always so the only level 6 thing I have on me is actually Richie's helmet and that's just unbelievable so we're gonna go up and there will actually be two teams fighting and so we are gonna come in there as a third party so that's something you should always do and you should first like find out where all the shots are so you can see or at least have an idea where all the enemies are and it looks like one team is at Rozok and the other team is pushing from the back so I first want to go around and go through the back entrance but then we decided actually a better idea to just go through the main entrance because uh, Yenda already saw some guys pushing through there so we're gonna go and come into their back which uh, now that I hear saying myself that <laughs> sounds a bit weird but I hope you guys know what I mean but yeah as we are getting closer I'm gonna let you guys enjoy the fight okay Watch out! Yeah, yeah, that's not bad. not that if the boots are too tight. So, if you have a cold, you can't get Poor guy dude, he walked right into that nade. So that was the last guy of one team, but there is still a guy in the broken house on the left, which seems to be the last guy of the other team. And as you will see, we will push him, but he's super fast and I and I absolutely choke this fight as you will see. So I'm gonna let you guys enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, this was a very intense fight against one super speed glitcher, but luckily the guys managed to kill him and now we can finally loot all the kills that are around. We are just hoping that we will be able to find, but these guys are 
already looted. This is my kill, oh, and so look at this. He actually dropped so yeah. much level six and a steal from MK. Yeah. So that's amazing. So I can yeah. finally loot up, yeah. and yeah. hopefully there will be more level six loot around. Yeah. But yeah, guys, this is pretty much it. I think this is the last fight of the video. So. I just wanted to say, uh, guys, if you enjoy this these fights and these videos, please subscribe to the channel. There is more coming and uh, definitely like the video and tell me in the comments what you want me to do after Metro ends in about seven days. So I can uh, still bring content for you guys. I'm planning to do some uh, tournaments, rooms, challenges and classics and stuff like that. So tell me what you guys want to see because I'm doing this for you guys, right? So any ideas are welcome. So leave your thoughts in the comments. Tell me what you liked about this video or disliked. And thank you guys for watching. Bye bye.